What's up everyone? So today's daily rev is a big one. A uh, big call, right? <laughs> the world is lacking connection and how do we fix it? Um so yeah, so pretty much like what I've been thinking about this for a long time and I've, I've actually talked about it before, uh but not in this much detail, but you know, it's funny, right? Uh social media, I feel it has a big influence on us um nowadays, right? And that, you know, it was designed for us to connect with each other. And it does do that. And it's a great tool when used correctly. But I feel like that we abuse it constantly. And um, and it's important that we actually use it for the right reasons. Or it could actually be really, really bad. With myself, that I used to compare myself a lot to everyone on social media, right? I'll see, you know, um, you know coaches... Back when I was a personal trainer, other personal trainers, um, you know, you know, businessmen and Ferraris and and shit like that, and just real dumb crap. And I used to just compare myself to them. And why am I not doing this? Like, you know, there must be something uh, wrong with me. And when I was younger, I used to get quite upset about it. But what I realized that you know that comparison is a thief of joy. Uh, Tommy Mantastic, it's uh, told me that quote. So if you're watching this. Um, yeah, and that quote actually changed my life. That one quote that I realized that by not uh, staying in my lane, it was really affecting me and that it was hurting my progress because I was too busy looking at in all the other lanes that I wasn't looking in my own lane. I wasn't f working on myself. And it was only when, you know, I really stopped doing this and I stopped, I removed distractions. I started unfollowing uh, things that didn't serve me on on social media and you know cutting negativity out of my life and just really focusing on on me and my goals then I started to move forward really quickly but I feel like you know that everyone looks around with each other and they try to 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 copy um, each other right you know famous like for example a famous, you know, personal trainer with a huge following does one thing. All of a sudden, you get fifty of them doing the fifty other personal trainers doing the exact same thing, when the one person is just actually being themselves, and then fifty other people are being unauthentic, um, and then they're wondering why they're not getting the same results. And the best thing to do, the best thing to do is be yourself. I believe that every human being has an incredible potential, and they're here for a reason. And if you are comparing yourself, if you get into a depressed state because you're like, oh, that person's so much better than me, then what's going to happen is that you're not going to be able to move forward and you won't be able to achieve your goals and then you won't be able to have the impact and leave the legacy that you want to leave to help the world and to do what you need to do and to, to give back. So the most important thing is, you know, be you, don't be someone else, you know, stay in your lane, concentrate on yourself and you will achieve great things. And I guess the way that we can fix this and, you know, the world is lacking connection is that first we have to connect with your, with ourselves. It's impossible to help anyone else when we can't help ourselves. It's impossible to connect with someone else if we can't connect with ourselves. So that's today's Daily Rev. I hope you liked it and there will be uh, many more. So please, if you're feeling... um. Yeah, so if you're feeling what I'm saying, please um, hashtag, you know, just go hashtag live, hashtag replay. Um, if, you, if you like the video or even if you don't like the video and you've watched it anyway, hashtag live, hashtag replay. I'd like to hear your thoughts in the comments as well. Um, but until next time, team, I'll be back with another Daily Rev.